Hey, everybody. Ha <laughs> ha. Spray myself in the face. <laughs> Welcome to Paint Talk. Still spraying. I have had this bottle. <laughs> As you see, it's still spraying. <laughs> I have had this bottle from day one. This has been my, and I refuse to give it up. It's working like a champ. Um, oh, that's too funny. Just kept going, honey. Did you break it? Oh my gosh, I just sprayed the thing. I've had that for two years and it's been working fantastic. Listen, we're going to work on part two of this. So yesterday we used mica in our DIY paint. Now, if you're new and you don't know what DIY paint is, it is a clay-based paint that I use on all my furniture. And it's DIY from Debbie's Design Diary. Um, you can use it on all different projects. Hello, Michelle. How's everybody doing? Listen, this is where we ended up last night. I am in love with this lavender color, so I can promise you, you're going to see this on a piece of furniture now that I know how to make this color. Um, what I loved about it is the mica just enhances and made everything a little bit more bright. So what I should have done was taking, now that, now that I know, I should have taken that mica and added it all to white and got really bright pastels. That would have been even more fun. I didn't do that, uh, but I do, I really enjoyed this color that we made and then this uh, lilac color that we made, but I'm going to know better next time. Hey, Pebble and Lindsay, you painted some today, Michelle. She painted. Hi, Lolly. How is everybody? So I just put a really damp coat of um, water. We're only going to be on here for about 15 minutes today. You guys, I have been back to back coaching calls and trainings and scheduling. And honestly, I'm just, I'm just about done. I'm just is your tired hanging out? Am I tired hanging out? I knew Matt was going to say that. <laughs> so, but I wanted to go ahead and put the next layer. I also taught in my membership group today, this piece down here. I absolutely adore it. We're going to put wax on it tomorrow for part four. Um, but part three gave us, can you guys see it? Part three gave us these colors today in the membership group. Really, really happy with it. We have to have a name for it. I haven't come up with a name. Uh, but we're going to put some wax on it. And that is in my Creative Connection membership. So if you're interested in that, um, we open in 30 days. My tired's hanging out. Yes, Tonda. <laughs> That's what we say around here. Not really, just Matt. Okay, let me wet that again. This Since this was DIY, it dries out really quickly. Um, we're going to build up some layers. And I'm going to come right in with the copper. Copper is pennies from heaven. And I am going to get a little bit of copper on here and start with that. I'm going to actually just kind of go over the edges of where I added in the cowgirl coral and spray that. And then I'm going to build up some more layers. The copper with that lilac color, come on. I mean, I mean, Woods. Matthew, mm. did you finish doing Christmas lights today? Yes. Awesome. I'm going to around here and start. Sorry. I recognize that voice. Sorry. Yes, I did. And I'm pretty happy about it. Yep. But now I've got to move on to the next one. Okay. All right. So I'm putting a little bit of copper on there. Yes. You like that saying? She's from California. Lindsay has never heard of my tires hanging out. You ever heard that? <laughs> what about have you heard my dogs are barking? My dogs are barking. Hi, Cindy Groom. How you doing, dear? All right, so let's blast that with a little bit of water. I try to teach everybody that when you're doing furniture, it's a lot like canvas, guys. You have to build up your layers. And in order to find your signature style, there's a few techniques and tricks that you can do. Um, to find your signature style. Now, I'm putting together a blog post for Thursday, so if you guys are not on my blog post list, you need to do that on my website. But we are going to send out a blog post that has my favorite tips for doing abstract. And we're going to have pictures. We're going to have step-by-step -step on what, what I really look for when I'm putting together an abstract. And um, you've never heard it either, Karen. <laughs> Dee, would you happen to have copper pennies from heaven in stock? Um, as of today, yes. No, as of Saturday, yes. But I don't know. Um, Reclaim Warehouse is really busy. And so I just, I, I can't guarantee it, Pebble. 
Um, but I, if you want to message me, I could call up there tomorrow and see if they have any. I don't have any here. My dogs are barking. Yes, I've heard that one. Uh, your gift guide is really, thank you, Karen. I had several people order aprons yesterday um, for gifts and for themselves. My aprons, they're really thick, guys, and they have this cord here. So they're they're really well made. They're, they feel more like a beach towel than they do um, fabric. So they're pretty, pretty well done. I'm very proud of the fabric. Okay. Lolly Lolly says, my parents used to always say they were going to see a man about a dog. I always got excited. <laughs> but around here we say, um, gotta go see a man about a horse. And what does that mean? Well, I when our boys say it, that means they gotta go to the bathroom. <laughs> Is that what they mean? Yes. I gotta go see a man about a horse. I don't even, I don't even get that. <laughs> I don't even get that. Okay, I'm just making some, I'm taking in here and using my cheerleader and kind of swirling in some more color, breaking up some of the, some of the fullness and some of the chunkiness here. And then I'm going to hit it again with some more water. I also have, I like where this is going. Honestly, I like this so much. I'm doing it. I'm not thinking too much. I'm just going for it. I pulled some colors. So I have this bright blue oil pastel. Yes, that's it, Matt. LOL. Hello, my jazz girl. How are you feeling? Love the gift guide. Thank you. Thank you, you guys. No, they mean mind your own business or they just can't be bothered that's to tell you where they're going. Ah, I see. That's what they meant, huh? I yep. don't know what my boys, let's just assume my boys mean they're going to go do homework. That's what I thought it meant. Boy, they have beautiful. Yeah, they do. I know. They, they have for I summer. paid Elijah today to put ornaments on the tree. He said, Mom, can I work for you? And I'm like, yes, you can put ornaments on the tree. You can go vacuum. You can put all of those tubs back up in the attic. Like I had him doing all these house chores. You're welcome. Yeah, you should see the tree. I mean, am I am I maturing or what? That I actually let my 19-year-old boy put ornaments on the tree? I was hoping he would have Julia come over, and he did, but she was doing homework. Okay, I'm just putting in more layers. And this wax, you guys, there's an iridescence right here, so I'm not going to cover it. Remember when we put the, the wax with the mica on it? It's here, and it is something fierce. Again, if I could wear a shirt that color every single day, big step. I know, Lolly. Like, I let it go. I let it go. I'm like, that tree is the only thing not done. Uh, Cindy Groom would like to know, did the shimmer from the mica show up more when it dries? Yes. Yeah. I know it's hard to tell, but when I'm doing kind of like this, and, and Amy messaged me yesterday. She was watching the live, and she said, because DIY is a clay-based paint, use more mica. She said you can kind of go in because it's really porous and it's going to soak it up. So she said you can actually use more. Well, that's She's, good info right there. I know. She messaged me. Uh, it's it's a it's an oil pastel. It's not a crown. But I am getting some texture in there. Going right through that copper. Okay. And then I have a, what's this one called? This is a light blue. And then I have the fluorescent yellow. Bring it. Okay. Don't be scared, Woods. Oh, I won't. Okay. There's not a whole lot that scares me. There's only two things in this world that scares me. Would you like to guess what those two things are? Me. Nope. Myself. Nope. I. Mm, nope. Hmm. My mother. Your mother. And Lolly Lolly. <laughs> Lolly. Scary. <laughs> I think Lolly probably wouldn't hesitate to probably slap me across the face. Honey, you act like she doesn't like you. I think she does. No, no, no. I, I think she does too, but I think I think she wouldn't hesitate. Well, I think that she'd be more more than happy to put you in your place, but I think she really likes you. I think you guys are buds. You have like a special kind of friendship. It's it's one based on sarcasm. <laughs> and get rid of the chairs, you guys. I don't like those chairs. All right. After tonight, we start making this look 
a little bit like something or we pull it all together. Okay, guys, we can't have all this craziness continuing. Lolly says, sorry, Matt, I wouldn't slap you, but I would punch you in the arm. <laughs> Ooh. And did you go over where to get that, Micah? If you did, I apologize. Uh, it's, I did yesterday. Somebody was asking tonight. Kristen, Kristen Seapack was curious. Kristen, it was a uh, counter culture. Where is it? I'll get it for you. It's in that cabinet right there on the left-hand side. Those bags. You got to open the cabinet. There you go. There you go. Go ahead. Thank you, darling. It is counterculture DIY. Yes. Um, so Amy Sadler, Chateau Chic, Chateau Chic by Amy Sadler. She is a representative for them, and she actually has a group. Uh, like a membership group where she it's called mixology and she teaches you how to create colors um they are not charlotte they are not okay so i've got my blue in there i needed i needed a little bit brighter blue um but after tonight well, i'm going to start standing back and i'll start looking at this and this painting that we did over here a couple of nights ago friday night i finished it up um, not, I'm not going to make it look like that, but this is going to look a lot different, but you've got to build up your layers and your character and just kind of see where it wants to go. At least that's what the way I do it. I have no technical training whatsoever. That's just how I do it. So I've got white and fluorescent and we're going to jump in here. I mean, I'm not going to jump. I mean, I'm just going to kind of go in with it. Matt, what was that that army movie you were watching yesterday that you like that I can't stand? 1917. Okay, who has seen that? And does anybody else just 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 not who I can't handle war movies and I you know, I'm sorry. I just can't. And so that keep I've been thinking about it off and on today. Uh, the movie's 1917 it came out last year, I believe. Um, any nominated um, it's, 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 a, it's, ba it's based on World War One. It's done in one, like the whole movie is one 24 hour period, right? Liz? Um, yeah, it's, it was a continuous motion film where it never broke from the next scene. So it didn't jump from like, say, uh, future to past, right? It was started at a point and the movie ended. You got to watch the process all the way through to the end. So you, just, you didn't skip any scenes, per se. Good movie. It's just, it's sort of like, I don't know. Um, yeah. Uh, no, no, no more movies. Um, See, I'm not alone. Let's... Uh, Turquoise Iris says war movies are awful. <gasps> I just, 19, that was just, I can't, yeah. Guess what we got on here this evening, honey? I'm just going to say, because you're not a very good guesser, we have Kelly Weiler. Oh, my girl, Kelly. I have Kelly coming in the group um, as a guest teacher on the 17th, you guys. So if you're in the Creative Connection, Miss Kelly Weiler is going to come and we're going to paint. It's a good question. Yep. Um, Erica, on, on the tube, she says, hello, y'all. Can, can someone tell me what can I put on my DIY paint canvases that will make it look glossy instead of flat or matte? Oh. Will Big Top do that? Yes, Big Top. I do it all the time. If you want glossy, you use Big Top or um, Liquid Patina is even better. Liquid Patina is super, um, super shiny. So that's what I do to seal mine where I have DIY paint on them. And I almost always put DIY paint on my backdrops for my canvases. Thank what? you, guys. If you guys don't mind... I would be really, really so gracious, like as a Christmas present to me. Did you know we only have 30 days left? Did you know we're on day 70 of 100? Day 70 of 100? I did miss two days, and then I miss Thanksgiving, and I will miss Christmas. But then that's it. I won't miss any days this, this year or this month. So um, anyway, back to what I was saying. As a Christmas present to me, every day for December, could you do me a favor? And that's like, what, what are you doing? doing? Would you share this video? That would be amazing. <laughs> it's not even going to cost you anything. 
stop the madness, says Michelle. No, seriously, I've done 70 days. Whew. Matt's like, can we skip this next year? That's not what I said. I said, we need to discuss it before. He says, yeah, discuss it with me next time. I said, last year, you were encouraging me. This year, he's like. Not at all. I, I get on here with you as much as I can. You do amazing. Yeah. You do amazing. Um, but as far as, a lot, lot of no on the war movies. Um, ha ha. Well, but I think I think it's just a, you know, war movies, are they're sad and they're depressing, but. I think they remind us why we don't go to war. Oh, China. I know. Yeah. You, yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't want to like, it's just hard on it. Especially I feel like mamas, grandmamas, like it's just hard. Like Holden will tease me and he'll be like, mom, I'm not going to college. I'm going to the military. And in my mind, there's a part of me that's like, that's a good kid right there. And then the other part of me is like, you're not walking out of this room. No. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like you have that whole mixing. So anyway. Iowa, <laughs> love your heart, Dion. Thank you, Tanya. Um, Tanya says there's no reason to stop at 100, Dion. Who said this? Tanya Mullins. Tanya. Tanya. Come on, girl. Jasmine says, Dion, you are by far my favorite abstract painter. Your paintings are always beautiful. Oh, well, you're very kind, but I have to argue with you. That is not the case. But thank you. They are not always beautiful. And Rob says, oorah. There's my military guy right there. Yes, I, no joke. No joke. I, I'm, I'm just like in awe. But when my son says it, it's like, hold on, what did you say? Aren't you like two and in diapers still? Like, wait, what? <laughs> Don't be talking about that. You can't possibly. I mean, he is going on his first driving test with the driving people Sunday. Yes, my son is considering Air Force ROTC. Oh, my heart. Tonda, you are my new BFF. Lolly, it's hard, you guys, to go on here every day. I know you can imagine. I know you understand. But the idea of getting, like, two days in a row off, I don't know. It's not that this is hard because we love it so much. I think it's just the make a commitment. And then also, I really like to reach that commitment. Like, Climb the mountain, climb the mountain, and then tag, grab the flag, and back down. See how fast? I don't know. You can tell I'm a competitive person. Passionate pigment says, I see angel, Thank you, Alice. angel wings picking up flower petals in, and then I with turned, their power. I turned it upside down, so I bet she doesn't see that anymore. Robert says he can still be a Marine. Oh, he can totally do anything that he wants to. It just, you know what? It just, it makes this mama just, I, I guess I, I, it's the fact that he even mentions it, and then I can't tell if he's just teasing me because you know that's that's exactly what they do. They just tease me. Um, but it's it's very honorable, and you know, I always I tease Matt because I think he probably would have gone to the military if I hadn't begged him to to never leave me. Did I beg you? Um, no, you didn't beg. You told. Was, there was a, I mean, there's a big I difference said, there. You are not going anywhere, young man. <laughs> <laughs> it's probably the way it actually went. Okay, so here's a few things I like. I'm loving, I still see the pops of the lilac that we mixed up yesterday with the white and the mica, the purple, the shaggy color, but we're going to have to put some more back on it. I think it's going to look pretty stinking awesome with this. Um, I'm taking my fluorescent yellow, but I'm actually mixing it with the white because the fluorescent yellow is, um, the viscosity is very thin and I want to thicken it up a little bit. So I'm adding the white in with it in combination and that's the color that we're getting. Oh. Now we're going to cover up a lot more of it, um, but that's just kind of where I'm just kind of going with my instincts. What baby? I, I kind of see. Oh, you see something? Yeah. Somebody had mentioned a butterfly. Which I can kind of see that, but I see um, kind of center right. It looks, uh, it's like a dark color. It looks like, to me, it looks like a, uh, like a mountain or a castle in the, in the, in the background. That's kind of what I'm starting to see a little bit. I don't see any of that words. All right. A little bit more. I need a clean brush. 
a little bit more of that purple. Now this I took beadboard, the DIY paint, and I put in the shaggy color mica and got this brilliant lilac color, which gosh, I'm digging it. They're, they're liking the lime color. It's kind of surprising, isn't it? Like, it takes you for a second, but I, I'm thinking. But that with the copper and this lilac, I think we, we hit gold, guys. Derek says he thinks he sees a face on top. Well, we're flipping. We're flipping, guys. We're going to be doing some flipping here in a minute? Yeah, oh, we're... there went my castle. There went your castle. Do you enjoy... Do you, do you, do you like flipping it? Do you, is there a particular reason why you do? Do you just see something and you think, okay, I'm going to flip it? Um, no, I it usually just... do it for the drips. Okay, so you, there is something strategic about it. Oh, yeah, 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 okay. yeah. Definitely just mostly doing it for the drips. Okay. I feel like we're getting a good solid foundation on here and I can move forward. So, unfortunately, a lot of the underlayer of an acrylic is going to be covered up, but it's got to morph into something else. Or it could stay here, but I don't feel like I'm anywhere near being done. Not even close. But, okay, right now my favorite parts of this are the copper with this fluorescent yellow that kind of looks lime, mm -hmm. and then this lilac. Um, and now I need a really big. I don't really see much with that in that position. Well, it's just going to stick out here for just a second. Somebody said, uh, I see, uh, Kel Kelly Weiler said, I see crosses, three of them. Really? And this? I think it was. I think it was in the other direction. It was one more back, started to counterclockwise. It's on the brown. Well, it's on the bottom. I think is what she sees. I think I see some crosses. And Derek says you dripped over the face. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Derek. <sighs> I wouldn't have done that to you, Derek. <laughs> All right. What do you guys see? Tripped over the uh, Betty sees a large bird with a green wing. Large bird with a green wing. This is the only green left. Over there and then over there. Uh, Lisa Dixon sees a purple tiger face. Yes. Tiger. We're back to those animals. You guys are always doing animals. Molly sees a cooked turkey. <laughs> Have you had dinner? <laughs> <laughs> we had dinner, sis. <laughs> Betty said, "Before you turned it, though." Ah. Uh, Kristen Cepax says, "A man's face in green." Uh, Pam says, "Dudley, I see a large bird uh, on the right." She says, "People are trying to see the face. I don't see the face." Huh. On the right, face top left, says Joanne. Yes, I see the turkey, he says. Map of the world, says Sue. Map of the world. Oh, I kind of see that. Okay, yeah. what did we stick the um, blue in yesterday? Daddy Straight sees, sees a ballerina. Did we put, we put the, we put it in blue iris, didn't we? Daddy says, name American face. Let's and it's gone. gone. Let's see if it's in here. <laughs> Isn't it here? No. Whatever, wherever you painted, you just painted over the face. Oh man, and it's gone. That's too funny when I do that because I don't even see it. Like I don't see that stuff until I step back. I'm looking for blue iris of what I used yesterday because it has. Charlotte some... says, "I see a wild boar. Nose is purple in the center. Nose is purple in the center." Oh my goodness! A boar. That's we haven't had that one before. Oh. Interesting. All right. I'm liking this. Hold up. 
okay, we're making a mess, but I need to do some more of this. I just had an idea of what I needed to do. Matt, you got a mess to clean up. I know. <laughs> it's joking. Uh, Lolly and Lisa Dixon see the boar. What? Where? I don't see it. Over here? Well, it's it's a wild boar. Nose is purple in the center. Its nose is purple in the center. Here. Purple. I see it. You do? Yeah. Here is the head. Nose is purple. And it goes back down this way. Do I see it? I don't know. I think so. It looks I it looks it, it looks gray. I mean it looks like it's gray. Um, Perfect remember, Soul Creation says the face was stunning. Now it's gone. <laughs> <laughs> Red eye green ear. Is it Oh, I think I see it. Yeah. Okay. Well, it's about to disappear. Honey, they, they're seeing all these wonderful images and you are Aren't I supposed to be painting? I tell you what, if okay, I see I see a face kind of like a, a cartoon character that never mind, you paint over. <laughs> Honey, I don't know where you're looking. You guys gotta be faster than that. Well, we're delayed a little bit. Oh. Oh, yes. Good night, Alice. Hope everything uh, is okay. Good night, Alice. <coughs> Hug, sister. Thank you for the sweet words. Perfectly so gracious. Says blue shooting star, or is that green? LOL. <laughs> Oh okay, goodness. Linda Meyer, I see a turkey out of the oven, right hand bottom. You guys. I know it. we just had Thanksgiving. I'm like, we just ate. Everybody's still eating turkey sandwiches. I guess parts of the country are hungry. And turkey a la mode, and turkey stuffing, <laughs> turkey soup. What's a la mode, Woods? Uh, it's turkey and ice cream. What? Have you not ever had turkey a la mode? You're cracking me up. You do, you do turkey? And you put no, you're making stuff up. It's hot turkey with uh with a little bit of ice cream on top. Oh my gosh, that sounds disgusting. You're killing me, and you're making that up. I'm just I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Um, oh, that's a pretty color. Okay, guys, I'm obsessed with how this is going. Face of an eagle, the blue streak goes across the face. The blue streak? Which streak? Large owl in flight, top right. Large on owl. On the right. Right here, I see it. Ooh, I see it too. That's, no, where did you point? point yeah. No, no, no. I see, I see like a, uh, it looks like a, uh, it's a, like a hawk, more like an eagle or a hawk. Kind of, you just come down with that blue thing that you just painted or maybe like a b1 bomber b1 bomber like a really cool b1 bomber with with feathers for wings i gotta look in the mirror the mirror this is not a mirror mid right side below no hand right in the middle a hand hand right in the middle Okay, here. Wait, I can see it in here. I can't see it here. <laughs> John the Mullen says, wait, now owls and hawks and eagles? <laughs> oh my, we're going to put oh my on the bottom of that. Oh my goodness. Oh my. All right, y'all come closer. Owls, hawks, and eagles. Oh my. Small, dark, red <clears throat> dolphin on this the is, edge. This is what, this is, I'll, I'll come over here. Because this is what I see. All right, where you see on the camera and even here here's a wing uh-huh it's in flight now it's like this okay 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 this is the body okay I and see the it. head and then the wing yeah but this one just was like really long but that's and okay this one's cut it's, off 
It's okay. It's abstract. It's totally. Abstract. That's what I see. I like it. I can see that too. I no, I really do see that. Birds in flight. Should we call it birds in flight? No, let's call it birds prey. No, that's owl. Sounds... An owl. Yeah, and then you got a hawk, and then eagle. Oh my. So do I, do, should I make this a little bigger or just leave it? Because this we could call this birds in flight, but what, you know what? It's not done. Earthly soul's like, finally, finally. <laughs> uh, Betty sees a dolphin on the other side. Hi, Tony Weston. We're just having a grand old time here uh, doing some abstract. And um, guys, we added the copper to today. If you go back and watch the replay, we added white, fluorescent yellow. We had a baby blue. Um, and then I got the blue iris from DIY back out that had the blue mica added to it. I also used a little bit of my oil pastel, which I have completely basically painted over. There's a few little pieces of it here and there, but um, I will probably be working on this one. Now, here's the thing. Because I'm working on this piece in my group, painting this piece of furniture right here behind me, I'm putting the wax on it tomorrow so I can get it staged and photographed. Once I get this out of here, we have a new buffet we're going to bring in here. Can't wait to get started on here. Lower Maldonado uh, has and a good name for that. So name. hold on just one sec. So it's I'll have called... a new piece of. I'll have Sorry. a new piece of. Shh. <laughs> new piece of furniture here tomorrow hopefully it may be one more day um but i started this painting yesterday and this so this is day two of this kelly uh yesterday we we played with mica powders in our diy paint for the backdrop um and then hey michelin and um uh, don't laugh at him michelle my word so anyway this is day two um, it's definitely going to need at least a day three. The lime yellow added something that I wasn't prepared for, but I love it. And then the lavender lilac color that we added in. Those two right now are a combination I haven't used before. It's good stuff right there. So remember that I'm asking for Christmas for the month of December, right? Fishes. I see fishes. I don't see fishes. She gave you the D look. I don't see fishes, but I do see the birds, guys. I do see the birds. Remember that for Christmas, I'm asking that you guys go ahead and share this every day, every day, because I've got 30 more days of my 100 days, 100 lives in 100 days. So um, we'll start December 1st tomorrow. I will end on December 31st and miss Christmas Day. And they'll take a smidge of a break, maybe a day or two. Um, love the colors. The lilac is gorgeous. Thank you, Tony. I, you see a shark. Okay. Oh, we're here? Oh, I see a hand. I see. Oh, I see a blue hand. And it's cupped like in the shape of a U. It's the wrist comes down at the very bottom, here. center left. Here. And it goes up. No, right there. Right there. No, keep going up. It's a big hand. Yeah, keep going up. The blue is the fingers. The other one's the thumb. Or it could be like a tuning fork, maybe. I think you're crazy, Woods. That could be. Thank you. But I do like, guys, um, write that down as a color combination. The lilac is what we use with the mica, and I added it to um, to the white swan. And uh, here. Oh, I see it, Derek. I see the see shark. Color? Good. Hey, I like that. Okay, I see it now. I just added that. But um, what I'm finding the mica is doing is adding, if I added, well, that's what I should have done. I should have added it. All those gorgeous colors that Amy sent me, I should have done that in all whites and we would have got really bold pastels. Um, so that's my next project. I know I'm going to save this and I'm going to add this to a piece of furniture next. Um, the next makeover we're going to do, like I said, I'll either start a new piece of furniture tomorrow um, or Wednesday. I know I have a guest coming on with me at one day. Uh, Lolly says, Matt, your eagle is a dragon. I see the head and face. I can see it be a dragon as well. I might get that as my next tattoo. You should say things. I see a duck head under the wings. A duck head. Mm -hmm. Okay. Hmm. Duck head. Here. 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 Where? Where? Is this a duck head? I don't know. 
I see a fish now. I see a big mouth uh, or large mouth bass. Here? No. Man. No. I never see anything. I see the little guy up here. We haven't touched him. Now, should we, if we turn this, you know, if you know if we turn this the other direction, we're going to have a whole new range of things. Well, let's just try it and just see. Let's just have a little fun. Okay, one time and then we have to go. Okay, one time. Let's just, uh... whoa. Whoa. All right, you guys. In 60 seconds, what do you see? I up. see this other bird here, its head, its beak. See you later, Tonda. Tonda's got to go. She was hanging out on the tubes tonight. Ah, take care of my Tonda. What do you see, Woods? Um... Joanne says, uh, or Heidi says, Blue Phoenix. Joanne says, Owl Left Corner. Uh, Tulip on Left says, Karen Brown. Tiny Light Orange Fairy says, Betty. Uh, Lolly says, My turkey is levitating. <laughs> Carrie G says, uh, Purple Fox Top Right. Lisa Dixon says, Surfer. What? Surfer, over there. Uh, Purple Papa Fox. Mac and Irene says, Hippie Pink One Top Center. Hippie Pink, right here. <laughs> you see the Hippie Pink One? Oh no, here. Here, here with like crazy hair? I don't know. It just says hippie pink one. Oh gosh. You guys are so fast. I'm like looking at it going, hold on, let me stand back. Uh Lolly Lolly says surfer with lime mohawk. Lime mohawk. Uh Judy says Sydney Opera House on top on right. Uh Derek still seeing these faces. Derek, I'm worried about you. Derek. Face, face top left is what Derek says. Top left. Over there. Uh, turn in so turn in so fuchsia or red is at the bottom. There's a face plain as day. There's a face as plain as day. Rob says, I see an Indian face top center light blue. Right here. But I don't see it. Uh, Charlotte says, uh, the tiny purple horse where you were just working. Here. Tiny purple horse. Lisa surfer top right. Pink haired guy wearing a blue shirt, says Lolly. <laughs> Betty uh, says a seahorse head. <laughs> I need y'all's imagination. Y'all are too good. Other side, Dion? Yep. Oh, see, it never matters to me when you say left or right because I don't know what is left or right. That's what we see. Because right. it's backwards on Facebook. No. It's different on YouTube. Nope. No. It's the same. Hmm? It's the same. Oh, so, okay, so what side is this to you guys? Right. This is right? Yes. Oh, well, it's my right, too. <laughs> <laughs> so he. We learned a lot here today, people. What? We I thought it was our like. Left and right. What? Okay, what's, what's this over here? Somebody said something over here, Derek. What is this right here, buddy? Redfish right. I see blue jeans, says Laura Maldonado. Derek right. Yep. Okay. Wait a minute. We have Gavin in the house. Gavin. Where you been, buddy? I know. Where you been? He been out. He been out uh, tearing it up. He's been skateboarding and and painting and going to school. All kinds of cool stuff. Snow Owls, Cindy Groom says. Lolly, Dr. Seuss. Al, uh, Lisa says, Owl Face, top left corner. Owl Face, top left corner. So, Owl Face. So, upper left corner, light right, green. Oh, I, I see, see it. it. I see it. Right now. here. Yeah. This, the nose. Those are the eyeballs. 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 You guys are awesome. Listen, let's come back tomorrow. I don't know if it's going to stay like this. I don't know for sure if I'm going to have uh, this piece that we're working on in my membership group. I don't know if I'm going to have it done and out of here or not. But you want to take a peek at it? Let me give you a peek. This is all that we have to do is wax it. I haven't named it yet. 
but it is mint chip Monet's garden. It has some um, mermaid tail and then we sprayed the entire thing with golden ticket. And then down here on the bottom, we even have some, some fuchsia drips and yellow drips. But our base coat was black and that was the challenge is that we had to start with a piece that was black. Uh, anyway, it's, it's um, gonna be great. We're gonna get some black wax on it. And, Go for it. I'm going to read this. Uh, Gavin says, I'm so busy painting. I got toys to donate, toys or toys, but only eight. I sold a dresser and bought toys. Very good, Gavin. The, uh, painting as well. Thank you, bud. Thank you so much. Seaworthy. Mm. I'm looking for a name. Uh, Laura Maldonado had a good one earlier. What'd she say? I don't remember. I'd have to scroll up and... Laura, uh, what did you say about the piece of furniture, sister? Me? I said sister. I'm not a sister. I know. I was talking to Miss Laura. Michelle, what are those paint sticks you were... Or, sorry. Um, these are just oil pastels you get in the... Like a Hobby Lobby or Michael's in the craft aisle. Swarm. Betty, that's great. Soaring. Getting a lot of praises on the on Facebook, Gavin. Soaring. Up, buddy. Laura is soaring for this or soaring for that piece. Probably this, right? Because this kind of kind of has now that we used um, the catalyst wedge, it kind of took on kind of a anything with type of wings, right? Sea glass green with envy. Ooh. Soaring is what Laura. Soaring. Was. Yeah. I like soaring. That's great. Is that for the, the, the painting? Is that the yeah the painting? Is that the original way you, you anticipated hanging? I don't know, because it's not done. Like, like I know the painting. Okay, soaring. Can y'all remember that, Laura? Soaring. Soaring as the name. I like that. But I also just feel like it's not anywhere near done. Like, I still feel like it needs, I don't know, but it does kind of look like a, a flock of animals, like, winged animals i see yeah i see a lot of winged animals i actually see a a profile of a road runner kind of top center right well i don't mind going that direction if, if, if you guys see birds and stuff with wings i don't mind going that that direction <laughs> i need some black and some white i need lisa dixon's imagination because she can see a pink baby thank you tony eater. I see a pink baby anteater. I need I need mm -hmm. her imagination. Lisa, what? Hmm. Pink baby anteater. The only pink in here is here or here. Keep going. There's there's quite a bit in there. Well, I mean, there's little, little, little. Well, but that's she, why I think she, she said, said baby. baby. I think that's why she said baby. I love it. But maybe she's just trolling me. You need help with yours? Maybe she's just saying, hey, let's just say a bunch of words and make Matt read them. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Try to read them. All right. We're back the way we were a second ago. What do you see? Four okay, years. I see my dragon. You think Laura said sore originally? I okay. see my tuning fork. Oh, it's lilac. Okay, Lisa, there is a lot of that. Oh, and we flipped it. We flipped it. Heidi McClear says, ha ha, pink baby anteater wins Facebook tonight. <laughs> uh, diving bird says, uh, I see a diving bird. That's what she says. Betty wants blooming. Winter in Paradise says Gavin. I, Laura says I see a ship top right before you flipped it. <laughs> okay, sorry. Before you flipped it. Yeah. Perfectly souls is oodles of birds. I, I do. I see a lot of birds. In Me too. I think it's the wings. Um, people are still commenting on the duck head. Now look over to your right under the wings. Above the yellow is a duck head. Oh, I see it now. Okay, I see it now. Over here? Nope. Come down under the bird. Under the bird? Under the dragon to your left, where the white is. Here? Kind of up a little bit. Here? In this and that area, yeah. There's a duck head. Mm-hmm. 
Uh, he painted over it so really like <laughs> It's like I'm going right for the right for it. You just, if you quit painting. I can't. Just long enough you for us still... to have a good time. No. Seeing images and, and talking about anteaters and dragons. <laughs> I'm like, I want to paint. <laughs> Gavin really likes it when you snort. I don't snort, Gavin. I don't even know what you're talking about. Yeah, you, you tend to snort sometimes. Oh. You guys are teasing me now. But you you kind of you kind of do that when you laugh. And it's okay. It's okay. Oh god. Oh. You can't be right. Lolly says wings of change. Mm -hmm. Ooh, that's a good one. Gavin says his mom snorts too. Uh, Cindy Groove says, your finger was right on the duck head, the dark blue. I see a hummingbird now. Really, we're really caught on these birds. What if we... Let's well, remember the other day we were on horses and, and lions. Lion, yeah, tigers. Yeah, that's true. Wing, wisp, wing of winter. Rob says, wings of flight. Let's just call it Air Force. No, that's not. No. Good. Maybe just wings. No, I like soaring. What's that one song with Ben Midler? Like... You are the wind beneath my wings. Mm. I don't know, honey. I've never heard that song before. Never heard that song? Mm. It's a good song. It's an oldie, but it's a goodie. Mm. Gavin says Space Force. <laughs> That's pretty good, Gavin. That's clever. Gavin, you've been doing a lot of work, buddy. You've been working Proud hard, you. yeah. Proud of you, bud. Summer flight. Wings of flight. All right. All right take a break. Flight. I got to stop with it. I got to stop. I got to walk soaring away. Serenity. I'll come back in here tomorrow. Mooring, soaring serenity. That's pretty. Wind beneath my wings. Soaring winter blue. You know what, Gav? I'm so proud of you. Did you see that I shared you on my page a couple of days ago? And did you see how many likes <clears throat> and comments that you received on my page? Gav, be sure you go. If you haven't seen, I don't know whether you have or not. But the one your mom took pictures of you, I shared it and asked everybody to go follow you on your um, on your Facebook page. Um yeah. Oh, yeah. And there were so many people um, that were just so proud of you and so complimentary. So she's never watched Beaches with that. Oh, Tracy, no. I have. I was just messing with him. Trust me. I love that movie. I will totally go look. You are so nice. Thank you. Wow. No, well, you deserve it, buddy. I'm just, I share people's pages all the time. I think Gavin inspired me to do a series of paintings. And then we're going to auction them off. And then we're going to take that money and go buy toys for kids. Are you going to paint too? Or am I doing all this? I think we could collaborate. I mean, if we collaborate, we, we might be able to put our stuff in like, like France, maybe. Do you mean collaborate? You and I? Sure. Or do you mean... Oh, yes, Bette Midler. Um, I'm very familiar with the song and the CD and the movie. And it all was of in it. a movie. I don't know if you've seen he's it. Just, it's called he's Beaches. A, he's just. It's a good movie. He knows it's. He knows. He knows that I love that movie. <laughs> You're messing with me. Uh, Gav says he's down. I'll collaborate with Gavin. He says I'm down. I mean, I mean, We're, his kind of painting and mine. It would probably. I mean, he would show me up pretty good, but it would be fun. Yeah. That's yeah. a good idea, Matthew. Do we have time for that? I, we better get busy. You better start painting. I told you I had about 45 different paintings in mind to do. You see a huge angel in the middle, a big heart right under the wing to the right, and a white dove at the bottom right. Okay. But I'm going to look at Penny's stuff first, and then we're going to sign off. Penny says, I see a huge angel in the middle. Here, a huge angel. 
Is this one of the is this one of the wings right here? Derek says, I think Gavin has got me to go donate some Christmas presents up here. Yeah. You know, me too. Gavin motivated me and I'm like, wait a minute. If Gavin can do it, I can do it, and it's gonna be awesome. So we're gonna do something. We're definitely gonna do something. Okay. I haven't figured it out yet. Well, I'm all in, always. Let's let's come up with something, and then we can challenge everybody else to post and a big, do the same stuff. Okay, let's do it, babe. A big heart right under the wing to the right, and a white dove at the bottom right. Whiskey Willow says, I see me. Dove. There's a dove right here. The angel is here. I see some doves. And then the heart. The heart's what I haven't seen. A big heart right under the wing. Here? I don't know what we're talking about right now. Penny? Penny says she sees a huge angel in the middle. A big, okay. Okay. A big heart right under the wing. And to the right, a white dove at the bottom right. And that's what I wanted to see. I see the dove. The heart looks on fire. The heart looks like it's on fire. Okay. Oh, here. Yellow heart. Under the duck head. Did we ever establish where the duck head was? Because I, I think I see it, but I'm not sure. Here, heart. Yes, behind the dove. <laughs> it gets a bit confusing. Behind the dove. So the dove's over here. The heart's over here. It looks like it's on fire. I got you. I got you, girl. Oh, that's good stuff. You guys are amazing. Thank you so much for participating. Tomorrow is Talk to Me Tuesday in my group. So it could be a little late. Um, would be after 8.30, probably even closer to 9. But if you want to join me, that'd be amazing. Like I said, I'll either be working on this. Could be something totally different. Or um, we'll have a brand new piece of furniture in here. We have a buffet we're getting ready to bring in and work on that next with you all. Everybody have a great night. Have a great Tuesday. And we will see you then. Okay? Night. See ya.